we're going this time. I think we're going to go round again. Or are we? No, we're going to go this time. But the race is on. Goddard pulls off to the left. Green light and we're racing. We'll get that whole shot. It's rid out ahead of Browning right into third. Bennyworth in fourth. A look over the shoulder. From cart number 30. That's Robert Stapleton. Bennyworth on the outside of right. Can he go the long way round? I can't see that. And he might lose out to Stapleton. But it's rid out. Brownlee, gap to right, gap to Bennyworth. Stapleton. Mark Gurner is well up. Just trying to work out. I think that's Anthony Harrington behind Rob Stapleton. Finished third at the last round, did Anthony? Car 56. Would love to go one better or two. First lap goes in the boots. And it's Mark Riddo leading James Browning. Adam Wright, Ben Bennyworth, Robert Stapleton, Anthony Harrington, Martin Gurnett, Nick Robinson, Matthew Forks with a penalty, and Mike and Michael Ballinger rounds out the top ten. Riddell now under pressure. From James Browning. I think he must have made a mistake, or Browning's got his mojo. As he's right on the bumper of Riddell. Right in third, closing up, getting into the draft from Browning. It was a bit scrappy on the exit of the last corner, and that will give Riddell a breather. Bennyworth is in position in fourth place, and appears to be there on pace from qualifying. It's not a rapid car that he's got to get that spot. He must like it here. Bodner well down the field, 15th at the end of the lap, trying to run down, Adam Brown and Paul Williams, we're back to the uh, front of the field, no change, Bennyworth still in and around the bumper of Adam Wright, but it's still rid out, clear, just of James Browning, this is the championship fight right here. suspect Eric Mignon might throw it down the inside into turn four not quite there forty three is Michael Ballinger ahead of James Edwards and we've had a change of position Browning is in the front, and Riddell is under pressure from Wright and Bennyworth. Browning takes a look over his shoulder. Martin 
Gurnett moving on to the bumper of Robert Stapleton. There's a yellow flag out. No racing down here. Ridout not done with the lead. Moves on to the bumper of James Browning. Browning goes narrow. Moves back to the racing line to take the corner. Ridout with a run down the inside into turn two. He's so far through, he's going to have to go through. Browning tries the crisscross, although I think that was just to cover off Adam Wright. And Wright's down the inside into turn number four. And suddenly, Ridout's got a few car lengths. Anthony Harrington and Ben Bennyworth going at it hard through five, six, into seven. Out of seven. And suddenly the race has got a different complexion. And as James Browning needs to find his way back past Adam Wright. So Mark Riddell leads by half a second ahead of Adam Wright. James Browning, gap now to Bennyworth and Harrington, fighting over fourth place. Gap then to Stapleton, he's dropped Martin Gurnick. Cart 77 is Matthew Forks, I think he's running with a penalty though. 71 is Nick Robinson. Behind him is Eric Mignon in car 55. Michael Ballinger has closed into this group and is now looking for a way by. Ballinger down in 11th, trying to break into the top 10. Behind him is James Edwards. Back up front. Ridout, right, Browning. Browning could get second here. We're four minutes from the finish. Four and a half minutes from the finish. Probably about six laps. Browning closing in once again on Adam Wright as they come into the last corner. And to set him up for turn one, I guess. But he's not close enough. Bennyworth is managing to hold off Mark Riddow. Using all of the road. I think you must keep two wheels inside that white line on the inside. The 41 there, James Edwards might have exceeded track limits. The race beginning to settle down. Fox seems to have seen off Nick Robinson for now. He's got more than enough on his plate with Eric Mignon and Michael Ballinger. Two minutes from the finish. And it looks as though James Browning is going to have to let go of Adam Wright. Ben Bennyworth is closing in. 
now this is about championship points here. He needs to maintain this third place to minimise the damage going into the second final later on this afternoon. Closing stages. One and a half minutes from the finish. This is probably the penultimate lap. Mark Riddout leads by 0.4 of a second. James Browning is 0.6 of a second behind Adam Wright in third place. And under pressure from Ben Bennyworth and Anthony Harrington. Harrington to the inside of Bennyworth at turn four, can't get it done. Sixth place is Robert Stapleton in cart number 30. Seventh, Martin Gurney. Eighth, Matthew Forbes. Ninth is still Nick Robinson holding off Eric Mignon and Michael Ballinger. And James Edwards is just about hanging on and in touch with the top ten in 11th place. I suspect this will be the final up board this time. Adam Wright's bringing him through. Sorry. Mark Riddout's bringing him through to start the final lap. Wright trying to get in his slipstream, but he's not quite there. And he's running out of laps to do it in. This is the final lap. Browning seems to have finally taken care of Bennyworth and settling on third place in this first final. Matthew Forbes is closing in on Martin Gurney before the finish. Can't see it happening, though. So Mark Riddell down to the hairpin for the last time. Adam Wright, James Browning will be the top three. Mark Riddell wins at Ella Park. Bennyworth will be fourth. Harrington fifth, Stapleton sixth. Gurnett is going to hang on ahead of Matthew Forbes, Nick Robinson, Eric Mignon, Michael Ballinger. Finishes in 11th place. James Edwards 12th. Paul Williams 13th, Adam Brown 14th, Mike Bodner finishes 15th.